you never know what you're going to encounter when you're out there, and that's what's really neat is that we're, we're going into their environment. My name is Abby Smith. I'm a senior marine biology major here at Florida Southern College. My research partner, Morgan Jarrett, and I are studying the impacts of reduced pH environments on the commercially important species, the flotostone crab. We have seen that crabs that are exposed to ocean acidification treatment, so a reduced pH, they have had less foraging success and activity than the crabs that aren't. First thing that has to be right is the weather. Um, where we snorkel, it's rocky in our tidal zone. There's not a whole lot of visibility on a great day. Um, so when it's cloudy outside, it makes it 10 times harder for us to find crabs. So when we bring the crabs back to the lab from the field once we've collected them, we acclimate them first by exposing them to some of the water in our ocean acidification system. After that, we take them one by one out and we measure carapace width, their carapace length, and each of their claws. And then we tag them with zip ties, which allows us to identify them from one another when we're completing our research. I've connected with almost every marine biology professor here, and I know a little bit about them, they know a little bit about me, they know where I wanna end up, and they're constantly helping you get to that point. I know at bigger universities, the chance to do hands-on research is slim to none, and we start from our freshman year with hands-on research. It's really, really cool to finally get to share and have like people interested and engaged in what you've been working on and what you find passionate. It's really cool to see other people passionate about it too.